You could visit him? I could what? He went to yours when... You could visit his grave. You haven't. <laughs> I'm not the one staring at the... You know. Sometimes you're an idiot, Grayson. Morning, Alfred. Richard? You know more than anyone that being a leader has a cost. You needn't shoulder it all alone. <laughs> I don't know what you're talking about. You know, at times, you can be much like Bruce. I'm nothing like him. <clears throat> Of course not. So unlike him, you would never push through an injury. I'm fine. <clears throat> See? Knowing when to take the help that's offered is a sign of a good leader. Don't forget that you have a rendezvous with Mr. Hendricks. Thanks for the heads up, Alfrey.
They can't have gone far. Suspicious activity reported. Officers advised to use caution. And that's Hendrix. We need officers near the Gotham Naval Research Facility. Goons. Hendrix has to be here somewhere. Nightwing spotting! You're going to die slowly. I don't grind you to pay us back. That makes it easier when the bad guys show up for you. I had a feeling this day was coming. You wouldn't believe the things that I heard at the hotel. Probably why the court wanted you silenced. Shit, they're real? That explains the masks. Look, one of my guys was feeding them info. And you know what? You should probably have all the same intel, too. Thanks for the drive. We'll take care of it from here. This city is going to the birds, I swear. Belfry, I dealt with the court. Got a data drive for the trouble. Excellent. Please return to the Belfry so we can evaluate next steps. Bravo's there, dispatch. It's probably time I left. I've uploaded the data we got from Hendrix. It should be ready soon. I've seen Bruce make that same face when he got stuck on a case. What's on your mind? Everything starts with Ra's al Ghul attacking Batman, but I, I can't figure out how it connects. You've never had to fight the League, have you? Raish is... was a fanatic. He formed the League of Shadows centuries ago to root out corruption all over the world. His philosophy, if you want to call it that, is that he should destroy things to build them back up. He's wiped out multiple cities over the centuries. He set his sights on Gotham. Batman stopped him. He was impressed. So he named 
Roos, his heir. That suddenly, even though Bruce said no thanks. But it meant Raish left Gotham alone. And that is until he showed up and... Bruce. Talia says Raish was behaving erratically when he died. Yeah. I put money on that not being the whole story. Hang on. What if our starting point is earlier? Batman died while he was investigating the Court of Owls. You think Raish found out about it? But why come after his heir? Raish cares about two things. Rooting out corruption and protecting the Lazarus Pits. So if the court was using an extract from the pits to create talents... Raish blows a gasket, steps in himself. Things escalate, both he and Bruce end up dead. And without Batman keeping a lid on Gotham's corruption, the court starts to stretch its wings. The League follows Raish to Gotham, and there's nobody to stop them from attacking the court. Gotham City becomes ground zero for a goddamn war. And no Batman to save it. I guess that's our job now. Yeah. It is. And we know what we need to do. We root out the court. And we keep the League away from Gotham. I really miss him. Excellent. The drive Mr. Hendricks provided us contains exactly what we need. I've set up a safe house for Mr. Hendricks. His original one was compromised, but he'll be all right now. Glad to hear it. <laughs>